Hello um, and welcome to my InDesign basic tutorials. Um, one of the things we like to do is wrap text around shapes. So what I'm going to do is actually show you in this in this tutorial how to do that in a really simple way. Um, and it shouldn't take you more than two minutes, three minutes to do tops. So what I've got here is three columns. What I would like to do is put my logo, which is right here, on top of it. As we can drop that on there. As you can see, my logo is sitting right here. I'm just going to put this in the middle, right there, in the middle of the page. So at the moment, it's sitting on top of the text. Um, but what I actually want it to do is actually wrap around this circle here. So I'm going to show you really quick steps here. So, just, so I'm just going to show you really quick steps how to wrap this, this, this text around this black line here. First of all, select your, uh, your image. Go to Window at the top on your menu bar. Click on there. You get a drop-down menu. If we roll down all the way to text wrap and click on there, or we can press Control, Alt, and W, if we click on there, this box will appear. What we've got here is different options. And if you roll over each of these options, it tells you what they do. So the first one here is no text wrap. The second one is wrap around a bounding box, as you can see. The second one, the third one, sorry, is a wrap around the object shape. So at the moment, the object shape is um, the square. But we'll go on to that in a second. Then jump object, we'll click on that, see what happens. And then we've got this one here, which is jump to next column. If I click on there onto the wrap around object shape, and if I click on to invert, what happens? Click, it does, it kind of goes in between like that, still underneath it, not totally what I want. These are different options we can do. If you look at this one here, this area here, this is the offset. These are the offset buttons or offset um, controls. If I click on here, can you see a blue line start appearing? And push, what it's doing is pushing away my text away from this bounding box here. All right? So if I just push it down to 10 so you can see a bit more pronounced. If I look here, it says wrap options. It says wrap to both right and left sides, which I want. But what I want to do is actually wrap it around this black circle. At the moment, it's the same as clipping. But if I drop down the contour options right there, drop down there, I've got some more options here. Graphic frame, alpha channel, and bounding box. Nothing's really going to change too much. Unless I click on this one here, which is detect edges. All right. So what detect edges does, it detects what's around our box and wraps our circle around there. So I'm going to reduce this a little bit so it's not so pronounced. To about that, about four, there you go. Now if I click away, we've now got our image with our text wrapped around my logo there. So that is quite simply how you wrap text around shapes and images in InDesign. Thank you very much. If you've got any comments, please just drop them in the comments box below and I'll do my best to help you out.